Alright, how's it going? Today I'm getting around to checking out the demo version of the Clone Wars Revised. I've had a fair few people request that I take a look at it, so here we are. So some of you may remember the mod called A Galaxy Divided. It was a Clone Wars TV series mod that was unfortunately deleted some time ago. But now, it's back, just under a new name, The Clone Wars Revised. The demo we currently have isn't just a carbon copy of the old mod, it does take on a form of its own. We don't have access to a whole lot yet, but just a quick look through their latest article on ModDB shows some pretty cool stuff in the pipeline. With that said, today we're taking a look at what Conquest on Megiddo has to offer, so let's get started. Okay, here we are on my Guido. So I'm playing my Guido because the rosters are fairly varied, so you kind of get a good feel for the mod and what the mo models are like on this map. So I'm going to start on the Republic side. So we got Galact Galactic Marines, can't talk today, Rocketeers, a 212th Airborne Sniper, a 501st Engineer, 501st Medic, uh, Marine, Galactic Marine Gunner, and Commander Bakara. I love this model. He's going to be a ton of fun. He has an Orbital Strike, so we're going to hopefully going to be able to get that to work. On the CIS side, might as well start from the bottom. We got Magna Guards, uh, Command Battle Droids, these cool looking uh, skinned Commando Droids, Droidicas, Supers, Engineers with the camo. They look pretty cool with the like Trando shotgun. Uh, droid Snipers, B1 Battle Droids, or Security B1 Battle Droids, Heavy Class, and Standard Battle Droids. So we're going to start on the clone side because clones are awesome. Uh, I do like how the text is yellow as well. It makes it a little bit easier to see. Let's start as... I think I kind of want to start as backer just for the hell of it. So, already you can see one of my absolute favorite features is the, uh... Of course I got a team kill already. Son of a bitch. Uh, anyways, my... Essentially my favorite feature... Well, that's just a good start, isn't it? My favorite feature, as I was trying to say, is the, uh... The new crosshair. It's really, really nice and really useful. And I think I'm just gonna commit suicide here. Just to get rid of him. Oh my god, I didn't die and actually kill I killed a ton of them, holy shit! That was incredibly lucky, let's pick up that health. One other thing you should note pretty quickly actually is everything deals a lot of damage and takes a lot of damage. You can kill things in like two shots, but you can also be killed in two shots. Kind of intense. It really does make for an intense battle. Whether or not you think that's a good thing, that is completely up to you. Definitely a, um, that's definitely a very subjective thing. Let's pick up some health here. Everybody likes something different. I personally don't mind it. It's a nice change of pace. It can start to feel a little clusterfucky, and you can get a lot of fucking team kills, like I'm already getting. But just look how you can lay into a uh, into a tank with a rifle. Not sure how I feel about that. Although I do feel I'm pretty sure Backer is a little bit more powerful than other units, but it it still sort of follows the same line. You can deal a ton of damage with any weapon. Okay, let's go. I think I'll try one more orbital strike for the hell of it. Get it on that tank there. That should be pretty good. Did it go through him? I think it went through him. Son of a bitch. So, I've noticed, at least on this map, if you don't actually, like, tag a unit with it, it doesn't actually stick to anything and it never actually activates. Although I have used, I believe I used one on Utapau when testing. And it works just fine on anything, so not sure if I'm crazy or what, but let's try and tag someone. Nope. Stand still. God damn it. Also, I think if you heard that while I was getting shot there, the sort of um, sound effect coming from Bakura. Not sure how I feel about at least that sound effect. There's a lot of good sound effects added, but also some sort of odd ones. There we go. There we go. Yeah, it's just kind of, uh, kind of strong when you get it to work. Yeah, so there's a lot of cool sound effects and a lot of... It's, they're sort of like half and half. Some aren't exactly the best, I would say. I'm not gonna bother playing as Mundy because it's just vanilla Mundy. 
And hopefully we can make Heavy and Hard Case proud here. I <laughs> only got two. God damn it. Yes, it's Vanilla Mundy, so absolutely no point. Why is there two of them? That's interesting. I've never had that issue before. Magna Guards are strong as hell as well. We're already about to win. I'll just let it play out. We can start another match. We got plenty more to check out here. Is he actually... That's cool. The Magna Guards are actually blocking. I didn't know they could do that. Quickly, I do want to get a close-up look at the Galactic Marines, because they are really, really nice looking. The just from the weapon model all the way to the actual unit model itself, they look slick. I think they are my favorite uh, model from this mod so far. Although, if you check out their ModDB page and the Discord server, there are a ton of cool-looking clones in the works. It's really, really cool stuff. Okay, I'm gonna up, uh, start a new match and hopefully check out a, check out a few more units because that went by way too fast. Okay, so I'll start once again on the Republic side. I think I might just check out the Sniper and then we'll hop on over to the CIS side because I kind of want to see what the scope is like. Okay, more or less vanilla with the added uh, sort of new crosshair in uh, in the middle there. I also should note, I believe, let's find a cool weapon model. Pretty sure this first, yeah, this first person models for like weapons and stuff, which is a nice touch. God, playing in first person feels so weird. I don't think I'm ever gonna get used to it. At least not in this game. Okay, hop on over to the CIS side. Let's go. Let's go Commando Droid. I think that could, that could be fun. That's cool. He's even got the blue arm. <laughs> so to activate um, the, essentially, instead of right clicking for grenades and second, all the secondary abilities, I should, I should say, you do have to hit R with these guys. Not sure why it's like that, but it's like that in quite a few mods. I'm sure there's a legitimate reason. I'm just. Not too sure as to why. And if you saw that there, that's just kind of cool. I'm pretty sure Grievous just spawned those guys. <laughs> I'm gonna have to try that out. Okay, so let's go. Oh yeah, okay, so this this ability is really cool. The reinforcements ability, you spawn more commando droids. And the best thing about that is commando droids are OP as hell. You can if you spawn those in the right spot, you will just absolutely wreck. Pretty cool. Definitely gonna play as this guy again because he's got a lot of cool features. I'll just spawn him in here for the hell of it. They should just. I think they. F Do they follow you? I think they follow you. I wonder if I activate. Okay, those two guys are actually stuck there. Doesn't really matter. Oh, there they go. So if I activate this. Yeah, okay. It actually spawns me. Not spawns me, but makes me look like a uh, Galactic Marine. That's pretty sweet. Okay, let's go Grievous, because we're going to spawn in some Magna Guards. Shouldn't be OP at all. Is that... Wait, is there two... There's two of us on the map. Roger, Roger. Yes. Oh my god, everything does so much damage, though. Really got to actually block on, like, my dumbass. I love the reinforcements ability, though. Really, really cool. Okay, so... I'll go one more life as these guys. There's one of these guys. So we got Thermal Imploders and a Vibra Sword as well. Although the, his E5 is absolutely insane. <laughs> if you can actually get close enough to anybody, you can just light them the hell up. Where am I gonna... Stop it! God damn. Duck and Deeply Sorry, like, God damn, I love the, uh, the voice clips. Here, let's try the Magna Guard. Man, there's a lot to, uh, to try out. Okay, so we move slow as hell. Can I block? I can block. Look at that. Oh my god, what is that noise? What the hell causes that sound? That's interesting. Okay, I'm gonna try going this way. Because going the other way is not uh, working out for me so well. Okay, so it's... Uh, 
The Electro Staff. <laughs> That's intense. Oh my god. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, let's try. I don't know if the Command Battle Droid has anything cool or not. Also, I'm sure you've already noticed, but the reskinned AATs and... I'm not 100% sure if the... Um, Republic tank has anything done to it. I think it sort of looked like touched up, but I'm not actually sure. I really want to play as Grievous again. The reinforcements ability is just too cool. Okay, spawn. Yes, sick him, boys. <laughs> I think if I just stand in here, we can probably get some good work done. Did I kill my friend? He's gonna kill me, though. Those Grievous sound effects are uh, intimidating, to say the least. Wait. Oh my god! Okay, I don't know if you could actually make that one out, but that uh, dying sound effect is the uh, when he was essentially blowing up in uh, Revenge of the Sith. That's kind of cool. Okay, I almost said Return of the Sith again. I al always almost say Return of the Sith, just because I always um, get it mixed up with Return of the King for some reason, like Lord of the Rings. Just weird, but whatever. Draedicas are also, you know, just a little OP. <laughs> I love the uh, love the shield. It really goes well with the uh, updated cartoon-esque model. Okay, I was gonna look at the tank here. Is it touched up? That's gotta be. That looks a little bit cleaner than uh, vanilla. I could be seeing things though. You can just fire with this guy in the middle of nowhere and just lay into him. Oh, I'm, I'm the last one alive. That's kind of crazy. I kind of can't believe... Oh, there's Grievous there. He's probably going to ruin this for me. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I kind of can't believe the Re uh, Republic actually stomps the CIS on this map. Just because I feel like the CIS roster with the um, Magna Guards, Commando Droids, and Droidicas is just far more OP. But, oh well. I think that more or less covers everything I wanted to show. There's quite a few more units to play around with. Every unit is actually fun. Every unit looks awesome. That's going to do it for, the, uh, for this video. I have one more video coming on this mod relatively soon. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.